Well, I guess in case this does whatever it wants to, uh, hey, welcome to Pokemon Violet. I still haven't finished Bayonetta. I got distracted. And I missed the recent Splatoon 3, uh, Splatfest, so that was nice. The Pokemon-related one. Anyway, yeah. I'm behind on a lot of stuff, so let's just get right to this. Ignore the time. Uh, sure, I, I mean, you can see the Ethernet cable right there, but whatever you say. It does a check every time you load a digital game, at least it does for me. Is that normal, or does my Switch just not trust me? Anytime I want to load a digital game. España. Did I hear... It sounded like a Mario coin noise. I get so thrown around. The hair looks so weird. I get so turned around when I hear random Mario or well, just Nintendo noises in general in other games. Not creative, so let's go with that. Oh god. This is weird. No preview. Yeah, I, d I did hear the, uh, the game certainly runs. And what a choice of a Pokemon game to come back to after skipping Sword and Shield, and I think... I'm not sure what was before Sword and Shield or after Sword and Shield. I think it was just so uh, I think it was just Sword and Shield, right? And DLC? So... Huh. So who did this? Who made this one? Who named this one? Uh... <laughs> I'll try to give a real quick rundown, but... Some time ago, when Animal Crossing was out, after a bit, if you don't recall, someone called, I think, a black hairstyle, which was pretty much this, Space Buns. And that person got ripped apart for, like, such a simple comment. And here they are, called Space Buns as well. <laughs> Just an odd coincidence. All these are pretty normal until you get to this one, unless these are actually called Space Buns. This hairstyle. Which, I mean, yeah, obviously, funny enough that I mentioned Twitter and that shit. Because, uh, Twitter isn't currently imploding. Where the hell's the regular haircut? This one? I'm fine with this one. I like this one. No, I'm not hearing the Mario coin noise. I'm hearing just the usual, uh, select noise. Like from the old start menu of Pokemon games. Pink bra- how is this brown? I like at least there's, you know, been a little more customizability as the games keep going on. That's about all I have to say. <laughs> Scarlet. That's not really Scarlet, that's more like a, a burnt orange. Just go look at the cover of Scarlet, that's... That's Scarlet. I don't even know what hair color I want. Also, I thought I picked... ...a slightly darker character, but... ...it's just like... ...a slightly... ...tan character. Can you not go back? I, I have confirmed and I have quit. I'm pressing quit. Would you like to go with the style? That seems like I'm confirming it. I, I guess I'll just stick with this for now. I don't know, I don't really care too much about the skin color at this point. I looked at all the hair colors and I just don't even know what, like, I don't see anything I want. Well, usually I go with dark skin and either white or purple hair. So that's kind of why I wanted to go back, but whatever. How is that blue? That's... That's just... Like a smoky black. I don't know, I... I can barely hear my TV. Because I'm deciding to use my TV right now, and speakers, instead of a headset. And I swear I'm hearing the goddamn uh, Mario Super Mario World, like the main theme, more or less. I'll put in maybe what I'm thinking of, but god, that's what I feel like I'm hearing. I know it's- it's- yeah, I don't think it's that at all, but that's what I feel like I'm hearing. 
I'll just go with this. This is fine. Can you not change eye color? What? I press confirm and it's the same thing. As pressing quit. That's quit. This is confirm. What is the difference? Sure, I guess. Oh, okay. I I just thought it was gonna, you know, confirm it. I kinda like five, I think. What is the difference? And just a little more open, I guess. Context. <laughs> so that's how they do it. That reminds me of that one, like, still image of, uh... Oh, well, that, yeah, the red is real red. That's good. That still image of some anime where a girl's taking out her contacts and she has the standard anime eyes. She takes off the contacts and it's a very tiny normal eye. Like a real life eye. That just... I, I can never not think about that whenever contacts are brought up about, I guess, in an anime world. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? These are odd. What the fuck? Yeah, you know, this whole time I was looking at the hair, I was thinking of Black Desert Online. And now with these pupils, I really am thinking of Black Desert Online. I think... Whoever decided to do the customization here was maybe looked at that for a little bit of inspiration. Black Desert Online's customization. Oh god, there's so much shit. Jesus Christ. So yeah, Twitter imploded. I don't really have much to say about that. I don't even fucking use it. I just like use it to uh, just heart things I find funny or, or save things I find funny. Retweet whatever, really. I don't really use it at all. I think I'll just stick with black. Man. Uh, <laughs> That's Scarlet. Not whatever the other scroll it was. But yeah, uh, Nebelian really, really called it. I just kind of thought like, all right, that's, that's a take, I guess. Bye. It's going to suck not, you know, getting instant news, but bye, I suppose. I was dead tired today. I got called into work. I came back. I maybe got food, put it in the microwave and just fell asleep. I woke up at midnight and Twitter, well, everyone's like Twitch title. Well, it's pretty much like, oh, Twitter's imploding, Twitter's dying, or some shit related to that. I close all my Twitch notifications, so I can't even look at them. I was so fucking confused. Yeah, things like Twitter's going to die, I guess. Twitter is dead. So that that's what I woke up to, and I was very, very fucking confused. I felt like I had whiplash <laughs> for some reason. I didn't even realize I fell asleep, really. So that's probably why I had whiplash. Mouth? What the f- I didn't even see what mouth was normal. Oh god, why? Why the cat face? I'm still here, how long is this? This is weird. I'm just gonna do that. I think it looks weird. Beauty spot. I don't really care. There's a lot of options, Jesus. Freckles. These are freckles? <laughs> Kind of look more like blackheads and freckles to me. <laughs> I think that's it. B to confirm. Weird. You can't change your language or name after starting a game. Why can't you change your name if you can't even, like, make new characters on the same account? On the same cartridge, I think. I think you can have multiple accounts with multiple... Well, a save on each one, a character on each one, I think. Right? I'm not sure. Does it still, like, erase the initial, uh, character? Or no? Oh. Oh, I saw that. Leading the way into the future while valuing our individuality. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, sure, that's what that says. Oh. It's time for you two to dive into the world of Pokemon. I have several times. I just skipped, like, one. Three, technically. Arceus. Ar Arcu Arcus. Brilliant. Diamond. I bought them. I didn't play them. I just kind of forgot to. Dr. Clavel, head of the Yuva Academy. Paldea is a sprawling region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also- why do I have to read this? It is also, of course, home to mysterious creatures known as Pokemon. They reside in a great numbers, in fact. Yes, I know. I've been here a lot. Your room is blinding. What the fuck is that? Why is everything Pikachu? Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas and skies, even our cities and towns. That is a car chomp, right? Why the fuck is that thing short? It's barely taller than Pikachu. What the fuck? It's like two Pikachus on top of each other. We humans coexist with oh God. I'm just gonna This is the usual shit. I'm I'm just gonna keep going. It's the usual stuff. That tablet is in landscape mode, it looks like, and he's holding it in vertical. Good job. A black tar Tauros? Tauros? That's cool. For right now, it's doing okay. Oh yeah, Scarlet has the other professor. That would have been the reason I would have gone with Scarlet. What? Did someone T-pose? Did I just see someone T-pose, like, a, just appear in and T-pose who wasn't even in that same group of people? <laughs> I, I looked, I swear, as I was looking away for a second, I saw someone T-posing. As it faded out. The Black Tar also pretty cool. Ugh. You know, the only thing I care about in Sword and Shield... I really liked Corviknight, and this video's crushed to fucking hell. The quality of that section. When they were driving- when that thing was driving around. Even in their video, there's like popping and stuff. They could've just pre-rendered it, you know? But instead it- well, good luck. Oh, well, bye, I guess. That thing's dead. We got pompadour pigeons. Parakeets. Para... things. I don't know, birds. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the... F Not the toucan, the fucking other one. Parrot. Fuck. Yeah, like I said, I was... I was pretty dead tired today. <laughs> Give me a break, please. Hey, white switch. You know what would be cool if that switch, n entirely needlessly, you know, unnecessary. But if that switch was the current switch you had plugged in, would be nice. I didn't even see what that said. Did it say? I was holding left for a second. <laughs> Your bag and hat are hanging here, but it's not time to get ready yet. Why not? Oh, wow. So yeah, I, if you haven't heard... <laughs> This game does not run great, even in docked mode. It's somehow worse than Sword and Shield or Arceus. Arceus? It's a new Nintendo Switch system, this one's gotten a bigger screen. Uh, yeah, it's not a Switch Pro, which... This could definitely help out here if it was a Switch Pro, I think. The issue, apparently, is that the whole fucking world is loaded. The whole open world section of the game is loaded. And that's why there's such terrible performance issues. Good job, Game Freak. I only learned about that after, you know, I bought it earlier today, fell asleep, and I woke up to read all this shit. <laughs> that's nice. I mean, at this point, yeah, just, just emulate the games. <laughs> Don't buy them. I kind of care about having my shit like on an official thing, sometimes. 
That's why I still bought like Bayonetta 1, 2, and 3 on the Switch. Oh, that's the exit. Alright. I bought this unknowingly that it was, you know, shit. <laughs> I st I'm still interested in playing it. So, that's, that's that pretty much. Wow. That was pretty bad though. I'm just walking around the house. And it's like stuttering a little bit. A lot. Uh, storage. So yeah. If you don't want to spend the money or you don't give a shit. Just, just emulate it. S Pokemon Scarlet and Violet were already like leaked. The full game. Like a week or two ago. Like you were able to emulate it. So just do that. And Bayonetta 3 was like emulatable a d the day it came out. So again, just do that. You'll get a way better version of the game. At least I hope this runs better on, on PC if you emulate it. I hope. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. I didn't even read what she said the first time. Well, it is your first day at your new school after all. New school. God. I'm so excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little longer. Supposed- oh, what? Their word's not mine. Apparently, there's something very important on your- on your- for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Thanks. Maybe that's the very thing you were waiting for. Get the door, would you- I suddenly want to burp after talking. Starting to talk. Also, why the fuck do we have that thing? I hate that fucking thing. Do forgive the intrusion. What the fuck? Hey, mom, why why does this guy have a key to our fucking house? What's going on here? You're Miss Vetty, right? Yeah, I guess. On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. Ah. And also for my delay in introducing myself. Hey, Premier Balls. Nice. I'm the director of Yuva Academy. Uva. You may call me Mr. Clavel. I kind of would have preferred the other professor, but... I like... Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll talk about that stuff in a second. The director, and you came in person to help my daughter with her first day. Yeah, Mom, you're not... That's kind of some feigned surprise if I've ever seen it. He has a key to the house. There's no other reason he would have a key to the house. Don't act so surprised. Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any failures on its part. So here at least are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Okay. That was an odd cut for the interaction. Goodness, you really needn't have to. What? Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? In the bedroom. Ah, no need to trouble yourself. Vaddy, I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I can bet you have some private matters to attend to. Mom. Why don't you head back to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. And all she'll need is three minutes. Now, Mr. Clavel, you simply must join me for a cuppa. This way. Well, how can I refuse such a kind offer? Yeah, Mom's already timing it in her head how long I'm gonna take getting a hat and a bag. And as well as just getting ready in general. Good. He has a key to the house. He let himself in. Ready? <laughs> yes. So yeah, I mean, as with Pokemon games, I usually do, at this point, I don't know if it was started with Sword and Shield or not. Maybe a little before. I do sort of look at the leaks, so. Yeah. You can press the X button to open the main menu, select save. When, you're when you open your bag, you'll find key items inside, alright. So yeah, I more or less know what uh, starter I want, and that's why I look at leaks. I like to see the starter, like, line, evolutions. 
Yeah, what is it? Yeah, I'll wait. I'll wait a little bit longer. <laughs> oh, just look at you all ready for your big first day. Yeah, you can't wait for me to leave, huh? Yes, the uniform of our story storied academy suits you quite well. Oh. Oh, gracious, how very careless of me. Had entirely forgotten that I've something else for you, Miss Vatty. Um, an important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? Yeah, let mom th get things ready in the room. I wonder what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director out and see, shall we? My reading comprehension just goes out the window when it comes to Nintendo games. I don't know why. It, it gets worse with Nintendo games. Ooh, that stutter. <laughs> that frame drop. Just on a camera panning down. Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. Just right here. We provide each student ent entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. Spur. Fuecoco, the fire croc Pokemon. Craw. And Quaxly, the duckling Pokemon. Pomp. They're all very good company, why they usually refuse to even leave my side. Yeah, look at that. The croc walked up first. What's this? Huh. So it turns out they're more interested in you, Miss Vetti, than familiar old me. I do wish I could stay and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off to my next home visit. I'll be at the house over there, take your time with your decision, then come find me once your mind is made up. I mean, it, it already is made up. Now if you'll excuse me until we, next we meet. I already have my choice. What a mannerly fellow a director of yours is. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose one, right? Not an easy task. It is an easy task, absolutely. I can assure you that. Why not take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones and get to know them? I know who I'm choosing! I'm sure they have lots to teach you. I'm choosing what I know who I want. Oh, but before you go, I got you a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going out on your own. Ro oh god, I... Why is this thing... Why? Since Sun and Moon have hated- or wait, was it- Y and X? X and Y? I've hated this fucking thing. Yeah, I think it was X and Y. <sighs> as long as it doesn't fucking t lives within it. God damn it. I hate this fucking thing talking to you. I don't want it. According to the instructions, you can check the map app by pressing Y button. It'll help you keep- it'll help keep you from getting lost, so take good care of the new gadget, okay? No, I'm gonna throw this in the fucking river. Now go off, have fun. I'm gonna fucking... Throw this in a goddamn wood chipper. Okay. <laughs> Can I not? Look at that, it's only letting me talk to the one, interact with the one Pokemon I want. I'm doing the same with these two and it does not care. Good. That's what I was gonna say about the evolution line. What is with Game Freak and making bi- everything bipedal? Everything that's four-legged will just be bipedal. By the end of the evolution line. I kinda hate starters being like that. The only one I really liked from like the newer generations, I guess, was uh, the starters at least. Being bipedal was... what's his face? The Incident Roar. I think that's the best bipedal one they've made as for a starter. That is the best one. You can guess who I'm going with. I mean, the duck being bipedal, that's normal, fine, whatever. The cat not being bi- or what? What? The cat turning into a bipedal is... yeah, no. I'm good. So you can guess who I'm going with. I don't care about the duck. I don't care about the cat. I want that. I like that. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, I usually also look at the version differences. Not really a whole lot. You know, just a couple of Pokemon, and I usually love to wonder trade, so... I'll probably get what I want just by doing that, if that even is here. I usually try and breed for, like, uh, shiny Eevees. So I'll, I'll just send those out, usually. At least that's what I did with Pokemon X and Y and I think Sun and Moon. I think. I did a lot of wonder trading in X and Y, though. That's what brought me... <laughs> that's what brought me back into Pokemon a long time ago, X and Y. Even though... You know, people were saying that's the start of, like, the terrible ones. I like it, uh, X and Y. I'm also... I'm fine with... Sun and Moon. <laughs> but I might... I might be blinded because I like... I like Lusamine, so... I might be a little... little biased with Sun and Moon. Just saying. Also, I can't run, if you're wondering. Oh, fuck. Your Rotom phone. The handy Rotom phone is a popular item used throughout Paldea. Adding apps to it gives trainers access to... The map app. I don't think I really need. Setting destinations, okay. Flying taxi service. Purely by the parrots. Can they really carry that? I don't think so. Why? I wish the Rotom thing never fucking existed. I hate this thing so much. It annoyed me a lot in X and Y, I think. Oh, there you go. It annoyed me in X and Y because anytime I wanted to look at the map, I'd fucking talk to the Rotom instead. I hate the fucking Rotom because of that. I just want to look at the fucking map or whatever you did on the bottom of the 3DS screen. And instead, this fucker will talk. That's why I hate Rotom so much. This is Cabo Poco. It's not much, just a little pinch of the community, but it's home. I don't even know why I'm talking to you. I don't, I don't really care about you. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh. This, this is obviously docked, by the way. <laughs> Jesus. That's pretty bad. Nice. 